Dr. Dorso is trying to understand better how it is that HIV is able to make copies of itself. Now, when it goes through this process, the virus needs to make both short copies of itself as well as long copies of itself. And in some cases, it uses the same mechanisms. And so he's trying to tease apart how is it that the virus manages to effectively make both the short copies and the long copies that it needs in order to be able to reproduce itself. This research is important because every time we understand more about how the virus works, we are closer to being able to develop new drugs that can stop the virus in its tracks and bring virus levels down low. Dr. Dorso has been interested in studying the process whereby HIV kickstarts its own replication. And in order to do that, it needs to recruit cell proteins. It actually physically brings cell proteins and attaches those proteins to the virus itself. And it does so in different configurations. And what he's managed to work out is that some of the same proteins may be involved in different configurations and can lead to different outcomes. And these different outcomes are all very necessary for the virus to most efficiently make copies of itself.